Fire Viper families. I am so excited to say good morning or good afternoon, depending when you're seeing this to you. My name is Neri Finns, and I'm the very proud principal of Felix Varela Senior High. The purpose of this video is to give you, parents and students, a little orientation. We usually do this here in the building, but obviously because of COVID-19, we can't do that. So you're going to hear from all the administrative team and they're all going to give you a short synopsis of the rules and expectations here from Varela. Uh, we are all very proud Vipers. So ninth graders, you are now a Viper. It is a snake. Um, our school colors are hunter green, not ugly green, not light green, but dark hunter green, black and silver gray. We work on a block schedule. A days are one, three, and five, and B days are two, four, and six. Parents, we are a closed campus, which means the students are not allowed to go out to lunch, nor do we allow delivery of food into the building, just so you're aware of that. We have a cafeteria, and if the child forgets their lunch or anything like that, that is not a problem because we have things in place to help them with that. So do not worry if they do not have lunch. They will not go hungry. Second of all, we are a uniform school. Now we have added a, a, a one more thing to our uniform. Students must wear their mask the minute they enter the building. So if they're driving to school, before they get out of the car, they gotta put on their mask. If you're dropping them off, make sure they put on their mask before getting out of your car. Um, it is very, very important. This is to keep us all safe. And obviously this is when we go to phase two. We are prepared. We are ready for you the minute that we pivot to um, phase two, just so you know, little things that we've done here in the building. First of all, the building has been totally sanitized. It has been professionally done by our great custodial staff. They have all the most up-to-date um, equipment and that's been done. Second of all, we will be implementing social distancing. We have decluttered all the classrooms of non-essential furniture and the desks have been placed um, three feet apart and we have gone in and actually marked the desk with a craw, uh, like a green check mark with tape so that those are the desks that students are not allowed to sit in. So when a child walks into a classroom, he will see desks with marks. They cannot sit there. Teachers are aware we have done that. Um, we also have now dedicated the stairwells. On the right side, if you're facing the stairwell, the right side is up. And if you are facing the stairwell, the left side is down. We will not be able to do hallways because we have a center hallway, which we would not be able to manipulate. But as long as everybody keeps their mask on, we should um, be fine. I'm gonna ask you a very special favor. And what I need you to do parents and students is I need you to sign on to our Twitter. The school Twitter is run by myself and Mr. Mojica, one of our teachers. And we literally post things on a minute by minute basis. So if you want up to date information, that is the best way for you to get it. The Twitter is at Felix Varela HS. Again, at Felix Varela HS. It is very important that you um, follow us because anything and everything is on there. Also the website, the website is varelahighschool.net and on the website you will find um, faculty and staff emails, you will find a corner for academics, you will find activities, athletics, and basically anything and everything that a parent or a student would know. Other than that, I can't wait to see you all. I can't wait to hear you and see you smile at me even though you guys will have masks. Um, so you know what, Vipers? Mask up so we can see you soon. Have a viper day. over curriculum I'm here to talk to you about your schedules if you need a schedule correction and have not contacted us please email Miss Sanabria and if you have contacted us please give us a little time to get to your schedule change thank you Vipers. My name is Lazarus Leal, one of the 
assistant and principals here at Barella, and I want to go over some information about attendance uh, with you today. Uh, I know the first week of school we've had a lot of connectivity issues. If that happens to you, uh, we want to make sure we give you the right information so that you can correct your attendance. Please, if you have any issues attending a, a teacher's class session, email that teacher directly. That teacher will then receive your information, correct your attendance, or send it to the right person so that your school attendance and your class attendance are corrected. So if you have trouble emailing your teacher for whatever reason or you cannot find their email, you go to varelahighschool.net and in the tab that says about us, you will find the faculty directory and all of our emails are there, okay? Um, as far as admits go, if you need to miss a day, for example, you need to go to the doctor, you cannot connect with your teachers that day, there is a way to excuse your absences even though we're, we're online. You, go, you send an email, well not you, but your parents send an email to 7781attendance at dayschools.net we will receive that email and excuse your absences. We'll send you a confirmation email and then you can share that confirmation with your teachers so they can excuse your class attendance and your school attendance will already be correct. Okay, I want to wish you a, a great 2020-21 school year. My name is Alvin Brown, Assistant Principal here at Billy's Barella Senior High School. Today I want to talk to you about online etiquette. When online, please have your camera on and have the correct spelling of your name displayed. And for those of you choosing to play around during online learning, there will be consequences. Consequences ranging from SCSI, Student Success Center, and for more serious offense, expulsion from Miami-Dade County Public School. That's right, we will have SCSI via Zoom with Mr. Mojica. I hope you have a wonderful school year this year. Can't wait to meet you all. And remember, always a great day to be a partner. Hello Vipers, welcome to a new school year. My name is Mr. Mojica, I'm the CSI Director. Virtual CSI is open. If for any reason you are sent to CSI, instructions will be sent to you on how to meet with me and how to behave in CSI. Hope you have a good school year. I hope you never have to meet me. And welcome. with a couple important announcements for when we get back in the building. The first topic is about uniform. Remember that Barella is a uniform mandatory school, so you're expected to be in full uniform when we get back. If you have any questions about the uniform, you can go to the Barella website and check out the uniform guidelines. It is the polos, the activity shirts, club shirts, or athletic shirts as a top, or your jeans, your khakis, or your cargo pants on the bottom. In addition to that, because of COVID, we are requiring that you be wearing a mask all the time. Anytime you're in the building, you must be wearing a mask. If you do not bring your mask, you will not be allowed in the building. And because of the mask that your face is gonna be covered, we're gonna be super strict with you wearing your IDs. We understand we have not given new IDs this year and you can wear your last year's ID, okay? Ninth graders, you can bring the ID from your middle school, that is fine, but we need an ID around your neck. Okay, we will get those done as soon as possible. The second topic is how we communicate with you as a student. A lot of you have not set up your day school's email. We need you to set, you, set that up because that is how your teachers communicate with you. That is how we as an administration send you messages about changing like now we were changing from K-12 to Zoom. That is how you're gonna get the information. So please go to your portal. If you haven't already set, uh, set it up, you go to the tabs, the app tab, and go down to district email, and that helps you set up. It's a step-by-step, -step, super easy, on how to set up your email, okay? You should be checking this email every morning when you first log in, all right? Goodbye.
class of 2024. My name is Michael Vergara and I'm the 11th grade coach. Along with being the 11th grade coach, I'm in charge of technology. Right now, we currently do not have any laptops in the building. However, they're starting to trickle in and we did request more. So do me a favor. If you are in need of an electronical device, a laptop, do me a favor, send me an email at mvergara at dayschools.net. M-V-E-R-G-A-R-A at dayschools.net. On that email, please put your name, your student ID number, and the easiest way to get in contact with you. Also, we do have several hotspots left. We have, we'll distribute these hotspots to students in extreme cases that have no internet access at all at their house. Same procedure. If you need one of those hotspots or those devices, please send me an email with your name, student ID number, and the easiest phone number to get in contact with you so I can distribute that to you as soon as possible. Thank you and look forward to seeing you this year. Hello Vipers, this is Ryan Schneider. I am the Athletic Director at Fisbury High School. We're so excited to have you as part of the Viper Nation. If you are planning to play any sports, some things you need to keep in mind. You have to have a, over 2.0. You have to have a physical on file and you have to have insurance paid for before you can try out for a sport. In the fall, we have girls volleyball, boys and girls cross country, swimming, boys and girls, and football. In the winter, we have girls and boys soccer and girls and boys basketball. Then comes spring where we have a lot of sports starting with baseball, softball, girls flag football, boys and girls track, boys and girls tennis, boys volleyball, and boys and girls badminton. And again, if you have any questions for any of those sports, you can reach out to the athletic department. We have Ryan Schneider, the athletic director, Karen Courtright, the business manager, and Monica Babbage is the assistant athletic director. You can reach out to any of us three by going to the, the website and finding our contact information. It's a great day to be a Viper. I'm Jennifer Gambali, the Student Activities Director here at Felix Ferrell High School. And welcome, welcome class of 2024. This is such an exciting time. You're starting high school and starting off your four years of high school. And we want you to be excited and we want you to get involved. Get involved in clubs, get involved in sports, get involved in all of it. We have over 30 different clubs here at Varela. If you go on the website under the tab that says activities, you'll see clubs and then you can click on the list which will show you all the different clubs that we offer with the sponsor name and their email addresses. Over the next two weeks, I will be putting out on different media, on different social media uh, possibilities for the interest clubs that you can join Zooms just to see what they are, check them out, see if you might be interested in joining those clubs. And then in about three weeks, we will have a club rush which will feature all of the different clubs and you can check that out as well to see if you're interested in joining any of those at the time. I am actually your class sponsor this year, so class of 2024, welcome again. I look forward to meeting each and every one of you. And on September 22nd, we will have our first meeting 
It will be on Zoom. It'll be from 3.45 to 4.30. And I hope that you will all join me. We can meet each other. You can tell me any of your questions, your concerns, your thoughts, anything that you have going on that I might be able to help you with or answer any of your questions. And then soon after that, we'll talk about electing officers for the rest of the year. But again, I want you to get involved, have fun, and make the most out of your four years at high school. I look forward to seeing you soon. Make sure to follow us on all of our social media to keep up to date with not only clubs and sports, but all of the general school news. Thanks.